going everyone welcome back to the channel so in this episode i'm just going to take you on a bit of a kind of evening sunset walk around coaching here in Sarawak Borneo yeah we're just going to take a chilled walk I'm going to show you the local area we're going to walk up along the river probably go across the bridge check out what's on the other side and of course we'll try to find some awesomely delicious local cuisine okay let's go hello hello uh, okay clapis clapis yeah thank <laughs> you yeah, I mean, I did put a post onto my uh, YouTube the other day about trying to find somewhere to film the entire process from preparation to baking to eating uh, of this cake la piece. But there's so many of them like around and I've asked every single one in and around this central area and they've all said no as of now. There is just one bit of hope though. There is, there's even more here. Hello. <laughs> Uh, one bit of hope, uh, which I'll keep my fingers crossed that, that it will actually happen, but we'll just have to see. The thing is, is that they mostly cook and bake these cakes at home, yeah? It's actually all baked in their personal homes. So, obviously I can't really do that, um, <laughs> for obvious reasons. Um, yeah, it's more of like a, a personal thing. It's, it's more of like a family thing, yeah? They all have different recipes and uh, they want to kind of keep it secret. So that's why it's incredibly difficult for me to find somewhere to actually film and vlog this. But like I said, fingers crossed. But yeah, down this sort of waterfront, there are lots of these kind of, yeah, tourist souvenir shops, selling t-shirts, scarves, bags. And you know what, I think a lot of it is homemade. Homemade? Um, handmade, sorry. Because I've seen a couple. Hello. A video, guy. Yeah, a video. Sorry, cannot video. Cannot video, okay. Cannot video in here. Um, what was I saying? I can't remember what I was saying now. Uh, anyway, yeah. Um, handmade, because I've seen some of them. And um, yeah, they're actually like sewing and, and actually making them. So yeah, there are a bunch of these shops uh, that I kind of just got kicked out of. Uh, I probably should have asked if I could film before entering, um, but generally they, they're usually all right about it here. Uh, yeah, we're coming to sort of the end of this part now, um, but yeah, nice little cafes, lots of little lodges, furniture shops. So we are gonna cross over and get onto the riverfront now. I see a giant Pikachu over there. Okay, beat the heat. What's this? I'm guessing shaved ice, maybe ice cream. Yeah, ice creams and stuff. Hello. <laughs> yeah, like ice cold drinks of all kinds, types, flavors, you name it. They probably got it here. Teddy bears. <laughs> it must be absolutely boiling inside a boat. Whoa. I'm not sure what this building is, but it has the year 1879 on there. Hello. Oh, is this a restaurant, yeah? Oh, okay. What's it called? Ma I can't read that. Ma magenta, maybe? Magenta, that's the one. Check it out. Lamb shanks, lamb shoulders, seafood platters, seafood aglio, ribeye steaks and salmon, sweet potato fries. Wow, what a beautiful building. Again, there are millions of them here. <laughs> There's another one over there, like a little mini sort of clock, little clock tower. like a small castle almost. Pretty old, right? Whoa. So let's get up on the bridge, head over that side. Got loads of meat sticks there. Looks a bit sort of processed though, with like the hot dogs. And um, yeah, 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 just <laughs> processed, processed meat sticks. And I think that this bridge is literally one of the only bridges in very sort of, well, close proximity to this uh, tourist area. You know, we can actually get to the other side. You can get a little boat, but still, I've been here for three days now and haven't seen anyone in them to like take us over. <laughs> so it might just be like an evening thing. But still, the boat's there and I haven't seen any crossover, so I'm not sure. Okay. And just as I said that, there's a boat going over. I'm not sure if it's a taxi boat. Uh, maybe that's just locals playing about. I don't know. 
Got the whole river to themselves though. Be awesome to get onto a jet ski on the river here. I think that's what they should do. Jet ski rentals here in Kuching. Ah, oh, that breeze is so good. Wow. Hey man. Hey, how's it going? Yeah, river breeze. Love this view. Beautiful. And this is in fact my first time over the other side of the river and a bunch of you um, commented about the Cake Lapis uh, places that they are in fact on this other side of the river so I'm not sure exactly where maybe they're over there maybe they're just here maybe they're three kilometers that way <laughs> but hopefully if I walk past some I'll ask in there and uh, Again, fingers crossed, because I really, really want to film the, the whole process of these cakes. They look absolutely amazing, like beautiful pieces of artwork. Um, it's almost like mesmerizing looking at them, kaleidoscopes of cakes. <laughs> it's insane. Oh yeah, I think this is where um, they have the like water show, light show here in the evening. But I actually don't know the exact time. I'm going to have to either ask someone or search up on my phone. Do you know what time the, the light show is? 7 or 7.30. 7 or 7.30. Seven or 7 ah. okay. okay. Thank you. So this is actually the government of Sarawak um, headquarters. But yeah, it's Sunday now. So gates are closed. It is closed. And we can't go that way. That's the car park. So I'm just going to walk up this road. <laughs> See whereabouts it takes me. But it's a pretty nice walk to be honest with you. It's got this like whole road to myself. Check it out. What brand of car is that? I really don't know. There are three exactly the same. <laughs> Just different colours. I don't know where these cars are going. It is literally a dead end there. There's quite a few cars just coming up and I think what, what they're literally doing is it's going up here, U-turning, and just kind of coming back. I'm a little bit confused. And unless I can get to like a little bit of higher elevation here, I think I'm going to miss the sunset. Uh -huh. But still, this is beautiful, right? Look at this. I'd rather be here, walking here, than on that bridge with like a thousand other tourists. Okay, so we've eventually made it to the top of this sort of hill. There is a road going down there, but I'm just going to keep going up this way and seeing what's there. Well, the sign says Wisma Bapa Malaysia. It's like this little car convention today or something. Hundreds of them. It's pretty much the only cars I can see. A white one. Another white one coming. A blue one. What is going on? like motorbike gangs around oh no that's a proton one they all look the same actually but a little bit different where am i where have i come to hello how are you yeah just like teenagers gangs on bikes <laughs> i wouldn't really call it a gang but kids hanging out up. Hello, can we can walk this way, yeah? Keep going and around to Yeah, left, yeah. Okay guys, thank you. I might have to maybe ask someone just to see what's actually going on. It's got a bit of a weird feel to it. Hello. Like they're here for an actual reason, you know? I'm not sure what that reason is. Maybe this is just like this every single Sunday or every night even. I don't know. I don't know. Okay, well let's just keep walking around a bit. And uh, yeah, let's keep walking. So there's a barbecue over there. Now I'm just gonna walk through here, I am. Probably just gonna ask someone. just a little bit odd that it's very 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 close to the government buildings here 
so I don't know I feel like this is just a very peaceful protest of some kind I might be completely wrong though I have no idea hello, hello. <laughs> oh I put the camera she said hello she doesn't want the camera on it <laughs> what do you have just some drinks yes hello ah a coconut yeah coconut and stuff what does everyone do here what what, what is it for just people come to hang out just hanging out yeah really that's awesome okay cool bikes and cars and nice okay enjoy okay how's it going nice car really nice i love the color like my glasses no it's not like my glasses <laughs> I'm from England. From England, yes. Yes. Manchester You're local here, yeah? Yeah. Right, England, I love Manchester City, you know. Manchester for the football, yeah? Yeah. No. How long are you in Manchester? Uh, six weeks. Six weeks? Yeah. Oh. Only four, three days in uh, in Kuching. Uh, where three you days. On the waterfront. Oh, no, but no, yeah, no, over the bridge. You will you use the... I think so. I don't know how bridge. to. Yeah, I don't know. Use the bridge. I, I, I walk over the bridge, yeah. yeah, but I will walk this way, keep walking, walking. If you walk over there, you will find some canyon to cross. Oh, under? Yes. Oh, walking under the bridge. Oh, uh, because they uh, have a boat. Oh, uh, okay. To, All to right, boat. Yeah, okay, okay. Yeah, like one ringgit, right? Uh, yes. Okay, thank you okay. so much, man. Okay, okay. Have a good evening. Okay, okay. okay. Let's go over there. Oh, it's starting to get a bit hot now. Um, I think I will have to maybe try and find somewhere to get an ice cold, refreshing drink. Yeah, a bit parched. Hello, everyone. Hello, hello, hi. hello. Hi. <laughs> As you've noticed, I'm the only foreigner here. <laughs> There's literally no other foreigners. It's just me. <laughs> All the foreigners on the bridge. Honda. I like it. I think mean, that's my favorite one so far. So yeah, sorry guys, we actually missed the sunset sunset, but I don't know if you can see the color of those clouds through there. This, the camera's not really picking it up. It's like a really deep, like sort of magenta color. Hello. Hello. Who'd have thought this side? Wow, this is proper, proper local. This side, hello. There we go, you can see it better now. Check out that sky. Yeah, what was I saying? The local side. There is nothing like this on the other side of the river where all the tourists are. This is awesome. I'm loving this. this way and go up 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 can yeah and like keep walking around or dead end yeah so you can keep walking and go around around to the bridge yeah okay okay thank you all right oh, oh. I'm really hot now seriously humid evening walking for about an hour Check it. Well, this doesn't really look like a kind of walkable road sort of thing. Um, yeah, it's like a dual carriageway almost. All right, oh, we'll do it anyway. I don't really want to go back that way. Let's do it. So I've been walking for about oh, about 20 minutes now. It was really, really dark down there. Literally couldn't see where I was walking. But I've come to Kampung Gerisik or Jerisik now. And it actually shows that this area is a dead end next to the river. And this is where the uh, cake flippers, bakeries and stuff are. But I'm hoping that there's a little pier here. Um, after checking this area out, I can, uh, yeah, get to the other side of the river. 
but it looks pretty awesome here. There's some like food stalls over there, I can see some smoke. And yeah, okay, yeah, the river is just literally right here. Let's go this way. Looks like there's more lights and life down here. Let's check through here. Oh, hey, um, wow. How's it going? <laughs> All right. Uh, it's like a little seating area on the river. Awesome. There's another like seating area over there. I think my hotel is like, well, yeah, about a kilometer that way. But proper, proper local. Hi. Oh, they've got like Chendo, they think. Is it Chendo? <laughs> Hello. Hi. Hi. <laughs> Hi. I don't know if you can get any more local or what, from what I've experienced here in Malaysia. I've never been to such a local place before. It really, really feels like it. Not one single tourist. That I, well, I haven't seen one single tourist on this side. <laughs> it's amazing. I love it. Hello. Hello. Oh, wow. Are oh, you just selling the fish here? Yeah? <laughs> okay. Check this out. Ekor. Two for ten ringgit. Uh, ekor. I don't know what ekor means. They look seriously fresh and smell fresh. Wow. That just smells like, um, yeah, fresh fish. <laughs> <laughs> and it's like smoked. Oh, what's this? Egg, 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 egg. Salted egg. Salted egg. Okay. Yeah. Salted. Salted fish. Yeah. Okay. Amazing. Yeah. It kind of smells like smoked fish a little bit. Thank you. Thank you. Cats here just uh, waiting for their waiting for their dinner. Here is layer cake um, and bakery closed. More fish. Atifi. Atifi keklapis. I am just absolutely roastingly boiling, boiling hot and saturated down with sweat. I am in desperate need of some ice, something, some chendo or something like that. There's no way I can have some like fried chicken or or hot hot soup spicy noodle soup or anything like that no way okay let's go on the hunt for some maybe chendol hello do you do chendol here no 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 we don't have oh no have abc here you can ask it the abc yeah. oh okay okay thank you <laughs> all right let's go check out over here there's like the stall out there and then this one here and then this one here they're all like separate but it's like just yeah the the kind of Parking, <laughs> parking to the house. Hi. Hello, can I have the ABC, please? Okay, for sure. You have lots of ice. Okay, you have many ice. ice. Uh, have a seat first. <laughs> okay, thank you. All right, awesome. I'm gonna cool down for a few minutes. I can't wait for this. One scoop. Uh, we call it sagu here. This one is chin chow. This one is chendo. That is the actual chendo. Oh, yeah. It looks like noodle, right? Yeah. Some <laughs> kind of noodle. The green chendo, red kidney bean. It's so hot, even she's like sweating. She asked me so not to, uh, yeah, so hot. She asked me not to film that. So, <laughs> I'm trying to film. <laughs> my hands I'm preparing it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh, there, there's I'll the put ice. some ice. Yeah. yeah. That is what I'm talking about. Put the syrup gula afong, the brown sugar. Ma buka susu lah, Mak. Ma. Oh, yeah. Evaporated cream. Eh? Okay, put some syrup. Oh. <laughs> Overloaded that one. Yeah, overloaded. Okay, thank you. Awesome. Check this out. Oh, I literally cannot wait for this. I'm so hot. It's unbelievable. An hour and a half walking. Not one breath of wind. Just pure and out. Five million percent humidity. 37 degrees. <laughs> you get the picture. I think I'm just gonna like drink a bit of it first because it looks like it's just gonna kind of explode, overload. Mm. <gasps> Evaporated milk, sugar syrup and ice. Mm. Mm -hmm. 
going to try and get some of that ice. It's all kind of like, it's almost solidified again, you know, because, because it's so hot out here. It's just, I don't know what the scientific word is for it. Anyone know? It's gone into ice cube again in one giant piece. Damn it. But the milk and everything. There is nothing better than shaved ice desserts in any form, basically, from any country that, that do these. You can't, you can't go wrong with it in this heat. You just can't. And jelly, sweet corn and jelly and kidney beans. Oh, how fucking cold. Let's try this. <laughs> sweet evaporated milk tea. Mm. Oh well. Didn't pull the straw up, did I? So I've just got like <laughs> palm sugar. Palm sugar, yeah. yeah. I've just got a mouthful of palm sugar. <laughs> <laughs> okay, let's drink from the top. Mm. Oh. Mm -mm. <laughs> I need it a little bit sweeter, actually. I want to get that that sugar syrup up from the bottom. Mmm. Mmm. Oh, yeah. <laughs> that is damn good. Whoa. All right. Back to the chendol. The ice cold sweet chendol. <laughs> okay. Thank you so much. Absolutely delicious. <laughs> Loved it. Oh, wow. Wow, I really wish I was still hungry, but I'm just not. After those two kind of dessert drinks, the Chendo one, or sorry, the ABC, and the tea and evaporated milk drink, I'm seriously full. <laughs> but yeah, the girl was so friendly in there. Her English is really, really good, and she advised me to come back over to this side, into this local area, to try specifically these satay sticks, the chicken and the beef. She said they were literally immense. And some of the chicken as well here that they do, um, and the fish as well, which they cook in sugar cane syrup. So it's like literally caramelized, crispy chicken skin. It sounds epic, right? So I'm literally just gonna take a few minutes more chilled walk um, to the pier now. Um, yeah, I'm pretty tired, pretty exhausted after all that walking. I really hope you enjoyed the vlog today. And if you're not already subscribed, Make sure you hit the subscribe button um, because, yeah, I'm going to come back over this side, make an epic food vlog of this area. All right, everyone, have an awesome week. See you soon. Peace out. <laughs>